As I just finished doing this myself in a very long run I've been posting over on my other channel, I decided to make this short video today showing you exactly what you need to do in order to break the perk reroll machines to obtain every perk you could possibly dream of for very long god runs. Keep in mind this is a very advanced technique requiring you to travel to multiple parallel worlds. As such, you'll need to already have a very good run in the works, including unlimited digging, lots of gold, and maybe even a consistent form of healing as well. Once you can dig through EDR, extremely dense rock, you can visit a gold room or two in order to acquire all the gold you'll need for this process. If you're planning on doing this in a run, try not to reroll too much ahead of time, since that will only increase the amount of total gold you'll need in order to eventually break the machines. So, what we have to do is basically travel to numerous parallel worlds, seven for simplicity's sake, and visit all of the holy mountains there in order to load in at least 39 reroll machines. We're not actually going to reroll yet. We just want to load these reroll machines into memory so that the price of that first reroll is also in memory. So, if you haven't rerolled at all before this, each of the machines will cost just 200 gold to reroll that first time. If you already rerolled a few times early in your run, it's no big deal. Just make sure you have enough gold to reroll 39 times total. So, for example, if you rerolled three times during the first part of your run, all first rerolls will cost 1600 gold. So you'll need 62,400 gold total to break the machines, which really is not that much. And like I said, you can just visit gold rooms to get more than enough. Because you might want to pick up perks during this process, you should drop the reroll machines out of the Holy Mountains a good distance so that you can still pick up perks without disabling the machine, so that you can return to it to count it among the 39 rerolls you have to do in order to break the machines. Is this making sense? I hope this is making sense. I know it's a lot of information to take in. So pretty much what I'm doing is just tunneling through the world and loading in all six reroll machines, then traveling to the next parallel world and loading in all those until I have 39 or more machines loaded in. All right? Then I reroll once at each of these machines. So I'm all the way in East 7, the seventh parallel world to the east, and I'm gonna work my way all the way back to East 1, rerolling only once at every machine, until this happens. Congratulations, the reroll machines are now broken, meaning you can reroll for all the perks you want, stacking many copies of them for godlike powers. You don't get infinite rerolls, but as you can see right here, I tested it to see exactly how many you do get, and it's 978 rerolls, pretty much for free. Each one does have a slight cost to it, so make sure you have a couple thousand gold, but yeah, that's pretty much nothing at this point. After the 978th roll, it fixes itself, and yeah, that's a very big number, so make sure you get all your perks before this happens. And I can hear some of you asking already, why would I want to do this? Well, like I said, it's for very long god runs where you might want to do things like mess with the suns, or go into new game plus 28, stacking more love so nothing attacks you, stacking greed to get infinite gold, stacking more health to get infinite health, stacking extra lives, stacking shields, and stacking stainless armors so you take almost no damage from anything. So basically for the craziest of the crazies amongst us. Anyway, I hope you lunatics enjoyed this one. I hope it helps you. And I'll see you next time. Have a great day and happy noiting.